Linda Gabriel for Diet for Your Mind. Maybe you've heard of this book, Mindless Eating, by uh, Brian Wansink, PhD. And in this book there are some really great tips for how to arrange your environment to fool your mind or your mind's eye into thinking you're eating more or less than you really are. And one of the experiments that uh, Dr. Wansink carried out was to ask bartenders to estimate the amount of alcohol they poured into glasses and when they poured into a short glass like this, a short wide glass, versus a tall narrow glass, they always underestimated the amount they put in the shorter glass. In other words, they were likely to give you more alcohol or more volume in a, sm in a smaller glass, but the eye sees it as less. So take a look at these and see, I've been playing around with my own glasses just to see which ones look like the fuller amount, the larger amount. Now what I found is something kind of interesting, and that's that, the, yes, the I think the short glass looks like it's less maybe than some of the taller ones, but if we pour the same amount into another wide glass that is taller but wider, I think it looks like even less because you, you perceive this as a glass half empty or less than half full because the midline is so much lower. This one isn't quite to the top. This one goes all the way to the top and what's interesting here is it seems that for some reason with stemware, I don't know about you, but I think the narrow one actually looks like less amount and the wide martini glass gives the impression of a more generous amount, maybe because we see that big wide surface area. So I encourage you to test this at home and see wh which works for you. Uh, now, just in case you're not believing that these are all the same amount, which they are, let me just show you how this is. So I feel like the, this, these two feel like different amounts to me. This one feels, especially if I were serving something like, you know, yogurt and fruit, this would feel like the more generous amount. So let me just pour this here so I can show you that it is indeed the same amount. And there you go. Try it at home and see what you think. This is Linda Gabriel for DietForYourMind.com.